This is the TP-Link Wi-Fi range extender. This allows you to extend the Wi-Fi signal coming from your Wi-Fi router. You'll plug this unit into a wall socket halfway between where your router is and where the dead zone where you're not getting any Wi-Fi is. You want to place this unit halfway to boost the signal on into that area where you're getting no signal. This will push the signal on and allow you to receive Wi-Fi in an area where you wouldn't normally. This is easy to set up. We're going to look at two different methods to setting this up. One on pushing the button on the router and on the, this device and two we'll look at installing the app and going through that installation. Here I show you by scanning this QR code on the box you will see all the extra information on the TP link. I leave all information of the TP link in the description below. Now let's take a look at the instructions. First things first, let's plug in the unit and make sure it's powered on. Now press the WPS button on your router. On different routers they'll be located in different areas of your router. Mine's Virgin Media which is on the front. Now press the button on the extender for one second. The RE will show a green light and also the rest of the lights will show the signal level. Now we'll connect to the Wi-Fi extender. It will be named your router name but with a EXT at the end. That will be the extender itself. To connect to that extender, click on that and type in the password. Then you'll be connected and you're done with method one. Now we'll have a look at method two. This involves downloading an app and following the steps to make sure you're connected. I find this the easiest way. In the instructions you'll see a QR code which if you go to your camera you can then scan the QR code it will drop down a little box you can click on that and it will take you to the app or you can just type in TP link tether into the app store. Download that app and then we'll follow through the steps. You want to give local network permission. If you have, click on already give permission. Follow through these steps here. It'll ask here for an email address and a password. You may receive an email from them asking you just to confirm that that's you. Now we'll click on add to add a device. Here we'll click on range extender. Make sure the extender unit is plugged in and you have an LED light on. Once connected the RE will go solid green and then more lights will appear to show the signal level. Here the app searching for the extender. Here it's asking us to type in a password of choice for the app. Now it's scanning for our wireless router. Select your wireless router in your house or office and type in your wireless router password. Then click on next. Then click on apply. This will apply the settings. This may take a little while so I'll speed this up. It will load to 100%. Now we're all set up. And here it's telling us location looks good. What I recommend is having the unit close to the router to start with just when setting up. Then unplug it and plug it in halfway between where your router is and where your dead zone is. So you can now receive Wi-Fi signal in the dead zone. 
Now you're all set. The app will show you how many people are connected. Here it shows one client. Here I'll show you if you can tell whether you're connected to the TP Link extender. Go onto your settings. Here you'll see your Wi Fi router and EXT or just your normal Wi Fi router. If I click on my original Wi Fi router and go onto the app, I click on this image, go back just to refresh. Here you'll see clients zero because I'm not connected to that TP link, which is your router name plus EXT on the end. Now we'll go back onto the settings, click on your router plus EXT at the end, which is your TP link extender. Now we'll go back onto the app. I'll click on this image just to refresh and here you'll see one client. So you know one person's connected to that. Here I'll show you it on my PC. Thanks for watching, links in the description, subscribe for more and I'll see you on the next one.